Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? No, the fuck it don't. Also, I need to buy some Fluxweed. Can I buy some Fluxweed finally, please? Can I get some fucking Fluxweed? Hey, you, sir. I know you don't sell Fluxweed. But can I get some fucking Fluxweed? No? Okay. Um, shit. Get out of here. You're garbage. Get out of here. You're awful. I don't want you. You're ugly. Don't need you. Okay, 750. Okay, now I'm gonna need a beast feeder. Oh my god, this is, I'm gonna need so much money, but I'm such a broke bitch! Sorry, I'm a little hyper focused at the moment. Uh, um. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. Uh huh. I'm afraid of a circus. Wait, wait, what is this class? You had a time how bored I'd be in divination class. This divination class? It's at the top of a tower? This is a side quest. Oh. I am really confused on what this class is about. So knowledgeable. I'm getting the ding dongs. What do we have here? I hope those assignments were challenging enough for you. Yes. So now I gotta wait till nighttime. Yeah, let me just uh well no no no, because then I'll finish your class and I'll take it. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Renai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come, what do you see in your own future? It's not nothing good, I promise you that. Based on laws, uh huh? I see triumph, I see danger, I see power. I see danger. I can't get rid of this feeling of a coming danger. I see. Know that such omens are not damning if they can at least prepare us. And you are preparing yourself even now. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Channel your magic towards your targets. Descendo is a P for some reason. You have it. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? What does this do? Oh, I just smacked their face into the ground. Jesus. Deals no direct damage, but objects and enemies are slammed into the ground will suffer considerable impact damage. Uh, airborne enemies will take an even greater damage upon hitting the ground. Ooh, actually, that's uh, it's a little bit better than the pushway one. Oh my goodness, that looks fucking painful. 
Yeah. Is a force spell that moves objects downward. <laughs> oh my goodness. And put your newly home skills to the test outside of the classroom. Oh man. Jesus. Okay. All right. So what I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna actually reset. So these are gonna be my. Um, so these are gonna be my attack spells, and then these are gonna be my utility spells. So forward, backward levitate and downward so if i levit oh my god because it says airborne enemies will take extra damage so if i levitate them and then slam them into the ground it won't be fun flipendo okay what do we have here a demigod uh-huh now i'm gonna sit here i'm gonna wait till night time uh r3 wait yep Mine now, Demi guys. Wait, wasn't there? There was. Hold on, there was another one. Where was it? It was. Oh, in Professor Fig's office. That's right. Okay. Now we go to the next classroom. We gotta do classes, guys. We gotta go to classes. Oh my god, I gotta go to classes. Where am I gonna go? I'm gonna be late for class. Oh my goodness, where am I? I'm gonna go back into the greenhouse where everyone, like, eh. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I know, no. Bouncing tech to your tech to I almost said testicle. That sounds painful. Bouncing tentacular no, bouncing piranha plants are bad enough. Do not make bouncing con, uh, carnivore plants, lady. You're fucking insane. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flipendo? Chin up. Keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few pots. I'm gonna say this, I said this last time, I'm gonna say it again. I don't get everyone's obsession with, over her, over that teacher. I understand it. She's a hot redhead. That's fine. She's too much like my aunt. It's fucking weird. That's, that's how I do my check marks. Wonderfully done. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just mind the plants, please. Oh, wait, wait. So Flipendo, wait, wait, they go airborne? Flipendo! Look at that! You send them! Flipendo! Descendo! Knockback Jinx Flipendo, like Asio, is a force, but okay. I was not ready, but thank you. Professor Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. Hmm. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Sorry. Oh dear. Shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared, but really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. Oh, you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, 
The trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree. Unfortunately for him, its leaves were hiding a bow truckle. You may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely, but terrifying, I'd imagine. Uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Mm -hmm. Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. That, that, that's almost comical. <laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacula and, well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. Is he dead? I need to know, did this professor die? Did the plants murder him? I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. Yes. Be kind to the Wigan trees. How did you get on with those tasks? Fairly well. Oh, bugger. Kogawa! Weasley. Madam Kagawa, I completed the list of tasks you assigned. Wonderful. I trust you became more familiar with your broom through the process? Hell yeah, I did. Oh, yes. Yes, Professor. That's good to hear. Keep it up, and perhaps one day you'll have a spot on the Quidditch team. If Black ever permits Quidditch again. Well, with those tasks out of the way, let us get started. Glacius. Pay attention to your wand work. Oh, this is in a spell that actually looks like the spell. Yellow. Well done. I'd recommend that you practice your new spell here in my office before taking it out into the world. Freezes enemies, increasing the damage they take from a follow-up attack. Oh, that's actually pretty neat. If I'll... All right, I don't think I need the push away spell, so it's actually pretty nice. And Flipendo, I don't know if I'm gonna use Flipendo a lot. So I'm gonna, yeah. There you go. Catching them quickly. Confirm. Crisis. I think it's learned its lesson, but do continue to practice as long as you like. Kinesthesia is a powerful learning tool. Yeah, but all right, that was fun. I learned all my new spells now, and now back to the helm of Urkrot. Duplessio. Oh, I, oh, it requires Duplessio. Okay. Uh, I do need to do the uh, race. Um, how do I know how many I have? Like, it's now still says zero out of nine, but I know I've collected two so far. All right, we'll do the main quest storyline now. Oh, I need to go to Hogsmeade? Oh, that's f fucking no problem. There's no danger in Hogsmeade, so now's the time for me to take a piss. And I'm gonna just, you know, just quickly be right back. We'll be right back. We'll be right back, guys. You know, just quick piss. It's all right. Ow! 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 I just stubbed my toe again! Fuck! Ow! Oh, that hurts. Oh, that, that hurt quite a bit. Woo! Oh, great. Now you both get to have the assumption of me stubbing my toes. Good job. <laughs> 